Questions remain after Temple Police issued a vague emergency alert Wednesday night for a missing child. To be clear, this alert was not an Amber Alert. The notification did not include information that you typically see with an Amber Alert, like the age, race, or gender of the child. Six News reporter Sydney Deshawn spoke to the city about the localized emergency alert and why it was issued. The ultimate outcome for alerts in general and our social media posts is just for the missing person, child, whoever it may be to be found safely. It's a sigh of relief for Central Texans after a nine year old was found safe by Temple Police just last night. They had people searching on foot, they had drones, canines, they went door to door. But the search raised questions when an emergency alert was issued out and not an Amber Alert. With the information that law enforcement had for this particular alert, an emergency alert was sent out because the verified information needed to be an Amber Alert um, wasn't necessarily there. Amber Alerts are focused on finding kids suspected of being kidnapped or abducted. Megan Price with the City of Temple says emergency alerts cover anything from runaways and severe weather. We're unable to say how often these alerts will go out. Um, in this incident with a missing nine year old child that had been gone for multiple hours without the parents knowing the location or destination, um, Temple PD made a determination that a local alert provided was the best avenue. Um, but the child was also considered a high risk juvenile because he was under the age of 13. And also for this particular incidents weather with it being you know 100 plus degrees outside that also played a big role in issuing this alert a new texas law known as the athena alert bill expands the amber alert system however price says this case still didn't meet the standards the athena alert allows local law enforcement to issue regional alerts without needing to prove that a child has been abducted like i said a case-by-case -case basis of of when and what type of alert is sent out. And so for this particular case, an emergency alert was chosen. For Six News, I'm Sydney Deshawn.